I have the scoop on what the FBI was looking for at Mar-a-Lago. In order to understand the documents, you also need to understand the property itself. Having been built in 1927 by Marjorie Merriweather Post, the heir to the Post cereal fortune, it clearly illustrates that Post cereal was just as delicious then as it is today. However, for clarity, I was not eating Post cereal in 1927, so I am not a contributor to the mansion. The mansion contains 62,000 square feet of 128 rooms, of which 58 of those are bedrooms and only 32 are bathrooms, which seems a little bit misproportioned, but we'll get to that in a minute. The property was later donated by the Marjorie Merriweather Post Estate to the U.S. government in 1974 in hopes that it would become a winter White House. It contained 36,000 Spanish tiles that unfortunately by 1981 had fallen into such disrepair that the U.S. government provided it back to her estate, citing the cost of upkeep. Donald Trump originally offered $28 million for the property. However, after the inspection failed, Donald Trump was able to purchase it with the downturn in the market for only $5 million. On the documents that the FBI was looking for, the renovation loan. A renovation loan allows people to purchase a property and fix it up at the same time. Renovation loans can include such things as repairing 32,000 Spanish tiles, installing or rehabbing a pool, shown here. It is clearly conjecture on my part, but the renovation loan may have even included the $7 million worth of gold leaf that was put into the 20,000 square foot ball. A renovation loan can also include things such as phone lines, should anybody want to install them, other than the future president of the United States. And it can include more bathrooms, although they seem to neglect doing that in their renovation plan. Now, while we cannot guarantee that if you do a renovation loan, that you'll end up being the next president of the United States, we can guarantee that if you renovate your kitchen as a part of a renovation loan, that you too can enjoy post cereal as often as Meriwether Post did in her residence.